sound bites by Kyrie, and most of it you probably heard it already in terms of at practice and things of that nature. He came out last night, late last night, and and tweeted an apology. Mm-hmm. I guess after he received five <laughs> five game suspension after the punishment <laughs> from the Nets. Why is it so hard for him to say I'm sorry from the beginning? Uh, right. Like, my bad. I didn't realize, I, you know, people were offended because I tweeted, retweeted something. Not my intention. And be, and be done with it. That could have happened to hell last week. That's all they really wanted him to do. I mean, one of the things was to apologize. But he, he wouldn't do that. They said they g- gave him several opportunities to apologize. And then finally they said he's currently unfit to be associated with the Brooklyn Nets. And that's when they gave him the suspension. And then he comes back with the apology. Why is it so hard to apologize? Well, I'm, 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 good question. I'm surprised. I mean, why, why he didn't stay true to his word? Did not apologize. Well, he said he wasn't gonna stand down, but I told. I said yesterday Somebody, he was trying to save his job. Came back and said, "No, he don't care about that." But then he came back with an apology <laughs> after that suspension. He care about something. He care about something. <laughs> mm-hmm. I, just, I just, I just hate it though. I just, I just hate. You got to go through all of that. It's like, all right, you watch a documentary. <laughs> You see some of it, you look at the historical facts of it, that you agree with it, that you don't. And you say, hey, I agree with it, I don't agree But why are you, who cares, man? I don't care what you, you watch a documentary that you like. So what? Why you so, got to tweet it out? Why you right, he should have left it alone. Yeah. I mean, you shouldn't have said it. Just what just, you do yeah. in your own home. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I don't need to know all that. That's just short side on his boy. I swear, I don't. I don't. Kyrie, Kyrie really feels like he's the smartest guy in the world. Yeah, but I don't. Who? That's true. No, no, he, no. He, he, he really feels that he knows more than anybody on this earth, and he can back it up, which he can't, because he'll push stuff out there, and then he get challenged. He'd be like, well, "No," he try to, you know, play it off. Of, I, I don't know. I, I, it's, it's very disappointing. He speaks first before he thinks about it, because if he'd have just. I don't think he's saying he. Some of this stuff he didn't even really know was. So why yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like telling if he'd have just he done his research. He watched the documentary over the weekend, just like all of us do. Mm-hmm. He watched stuff on TV. Mm-hmm. He came out like, oh man, you know this and, and this part and this part. Not understanding the entire, you know, mm-hmm. historical facts of which a lot of people don't understand a lot of things that they tweet out. And you know, it, it made people say, oh, you know, that's really a bad belief. He said, no, I don't believe that. I'm just saying this is this was you know this is this was good. You know, this was good. This was good. Uh, you know, history here. This was good. This was a good. You know, documentary. I'm like, no, Kyrie. But he still has some personal stuff going on. Um, because mm. he in what in one of the interviews that he was saying something about nobody cared about how he grew up. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. See. It's stuff like that. Yeah. So, well, it's some it's some trauma. <laughs> well, I mean, um, what you're not do asking they? him questions on how he grew up. I mean, up. do they? Um, do they do they ask Kyrie questions about how he grew up? No. Do they care about what he's been through? No. So, so, what, so that's why he feels but that But that doesn't right. um, yeah. give you an excuse for your behavior you. and what you say. Oh, no, I don't think he makes yeah. He's trying to say it because I'm doing this because nobody asked me. But how, you, but how do you know that, though? That's the point. We don't know. Mm-hmm. And, and, and he said it in the context that he said it, and I was kind of surprised. I said, where, where you, why are you, you going, going there? with that? Where, 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 why do we care how I grew up? How you, what, what does that do you retweeting or somewhat uh, – Highlight is something that's extremely negative in the uh, in the in the history of this world. Okay, what I got to do? How you grow up? Right. right. I, I, I thought a good example. I don't know what I was watching, but they were talking about a a young a little boy on a bus. Uh-huh. You know, a young Jewish boy who wears Kyrie Irving shoes, and mm-hmm. he was hurt. He was like, "Cause you know, I'm not I'm not even going to wear shoes anymore." Wow. You know, mm-hmm. he's got to realize it's so much bigger than what him just saying what he wanted to say. Mm-hmm. People are on his own truth, so I, I don't know. That's that, it's just it, it's something that that's very unfortunate. But we, it's, it, this is not the last time we we'll hear about Kyrie. No, no. But they asked him though, did he have anti-Semitic beliefs? What do he say? What do he say? Of course he says no. But let's hear from Kyrie. You know, they asked him about it. Well, I mean, he just played that a while ago. Did, did he say no? Do you have any anti-Semitic beliefs? Again, I'm going to repeat. Uh, he didn't I don't know him. how the label See, becomes he, justified that, because point. you guys ask me the same questions over and over again. But this is not going to turn into a, a spin around cycle of questions upon questions. I told you guys how I felt. I respect all walks of life and embrace all walks of life. That's where I sit. But, but, but here's my question. Mm. Why I not? Oh, you think you know how to define right. anti yeah. I was yeah. going to say, does why, you know what it is? Why not just say no? 
What? Why that say? I mean, yes and no, and answer. It's almost like he he wants to string this thing out to well. I'm, I'm I'm smarter than that. I can't let me articulate. You know, give you some background. Just answer the damn question. And move on. Because when you when you do what you do, you leave yourself susceptible to other people's interpretation about what the hell you're trying to say. Right. Right.